the point is that your body is changing and you need to allow for that. Um, I don't think people talk about it. My mother never talked about it. I never heard anybody else talking about it. So it really was such a big adjustment to be able to turn around and, and say, okay, I accept this. I accept that things are changing and I accept that I can't treat myself in the same way. I, I can't be as rough with myself. I can't be as, as um, yeah, as, as, um, as, yeah, that's the word, as rough with myself. I have to be more gentle and, in being gentle, that made me feel less capable. And that was really hard for me to get over um, emotionally and mentally. It was very easy to just sit back and be a victim and go, oh, these things are happening to me and I don't know what to do about it. <laughs> so accept and forgive your changing condition because you know what, if you keep learning, you'll still be able to achieve amazing things. You need to be kind and forgive yourself. And you don't need to push yourself. What I mean about being rough with yourself is pushing yourself so consistently every day um, without the rest period. Uh, that's what I mean is you can't push yourself so consistently every day over 40. There has to be a rest period um, for your hormones to your metabolism and your hormones to reset and um, relax. So that's what I hadn't really clued into um, before 40. And that's what being over 40 kind of taught me <laughs> so far anyway. So yeah, your hormones and your health won't thank you if you don't learn to slow down and rest more. I mean, I have to say there was a program, uh, an exercise program that I bought specifically for women over 40. And that guy, uh, he, in his exercise program, he recommended having three sessions of at least an hour each of rest and relaxation a week. That was for his exercise program because he realizes that in order for our for us to be able to burn fat and have adre enough adrenaline to be able to deal with um, an exercise regime, we have to rest. There has to be the, 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 the opposites, the black and the white, right? So there has to be the opposites. In order to do the work, you have to have the rest period. So he recommended some kind of massage or hot bath or steam room or sauna, something that really deeply relaxes your brain and your muscles at least three times a week for one hour. And that was a non-negotiable part of his exercise regime. And he said that it wouldn't work. His exercise regime wouldn't work if you didn't do those things if you didn't do those three sessions a week which I found that blew my mind I'd never really heard of that in an exercise um, class or exercise course before 